LeBron James slams Russell Westbrook for a costly blunder. On their terrible final offensive possession, the Los Angeles Lakers' dreams of taking their road game against the Memphis Grizzlies to overtime were dashed. With little over 20 seconds left and the Lakers behind by three, Yaw Morant intercepted a Malik Monk pass aimed for Russell Westbrook, forcing Monk to throw it back to LeBron. LeBron tripped and took a few dribbles before looking for Westbrook, who moved towards the baseline in a quiet manner. Russ paused his cut and returned to the three-point line, trapping LeBron, probably due to the score line, though the Lakers didn't require a triple, and LeBron was stranded. He threw a ball to no one in particular, and it was intercepted by the Grizzlies. Ball game. Looked like Russ was going to go back door at one point, then he backed back out, and I was already in the air, a solemn LeBron James recalled. I had slipped before on my drive, which kind of threw my rhythm off. It was the Lakers' 18th and LeBron's 5th turnovers of the night. The Lakers were 28th in the NBA in terms of turnovers per game as of Wednesday, 15.9. Westbrook also had 5 turnovers. There's a difference between careless turnovers and attack turnovers, LeBron explained. We gotta cut down on our careless turnovers, the ones that's just unforced. We're gonna have attack turnovers, which is okay. We have a lot of attackers and we understand that. But the careless turnovers, where, literally, you just turn the ball over and there's no pressure or there's no reason for it, those are the ones that get us in trouble. It was a far cry from the two-man connection James and Westbrook demonstrated in the Lakers' triumph against the Houston Rockets on Tuesday in the closing minutes. The Lakers are currently 17 of 19 as James approaches his 37th birthday on Thursday. On New Year's Eve, they'll face the Portland Trail Blazers at home. Thank you for watching. Please hit the like button and share the video. If you are new to our channel, please subscribe to our channel Lakers Inside for more insights of Los Angeles Lakers.